Hey guys, it's your girl Aisha Shasha and today I'm going to be showing you how I remove resin bubbles with the airless light from resiners. This is such a cool machine and I really want to show you how it works. They also sent me this gorgeous craft mat. It's so, so smooth and really, really sturdy and it's absolutely massive. I really, really love it. It's so, so soft. So inside of the sparkly box, we have the airless light. It's basically like a mini pressure pot. And I say mini loosely. It's not that mini at all. It's actually quite massive. <laughs> So I'm using some epoxy resin. Um, this one is like a low viscosity one. It's from Fun Showcase. And I'm mixing it up here. I'm using a wooden stirrer because I know full well that wooden stirrers do create a lot of bubbles. So I really wanted to put this thing to the test. They say to leave it to work for about 10 minutes. Um, this was after five minutes and I was like, oh my goodness, there are so many bubbles, what is going on? And then three minutes later, it looked like this. And then another three minutes later, it looked like this. And I was like, okay, this does actually seem to work. This is good. The only thing I would say is that it is quite loud. So if you're not a fan of loud noises, then maybe this one isn't for you. But look at how clear that the resin is. I was so, so baffled. I mean, obviously I expected it to work, but like I was just still so impressed. So I'm yet to see how it works when you already have um, pigment or glitter inside of the resin. Um, so I will do another test to see how that works. Um, because as you saw, I just added my glitter afterwards and then stirred it in and just used it as normal. Um, but I'm still very, very impressed with how this turned out. Look at these adorable wings. Oh my goodness. These were actually for a lovely customer um, who was very, very smart and went to glitterbubble.co.uk and ordered herself some wonderful uh, magical wing hair clips. So uh, yeah, do the right thing and go ahead and get to your own. <laughs> After I applied the hair clips to the back of the wings, then I just used my Arteza paints in Coronation Pink and um, I just used it to sort of fill in the grooves just so that you could see the lovely detail. And these cute, adorable little clay moons and stars and clouds, they were just perfect, absolutely perfect. Definitely gives me little twin stars vibes and also a hint of Cardcaptor Sakura in there. Absolutely perfect. I love them. I love them. I love them. Oh my goodness. Ah. I'm so happy with the way that these turned out and I hope that you enjoyed this video too. If you would like to get your hands on one of the airless lights, then definitely do check out the discount link in the description box below. Take care, my darlings, and I'll see you all soon. Bye.